Women groups in Nigeria under the umbrella of the National Coalition of Women for Oshimbaju and initiative of the Progressive Project, CPP, are uh, speaking about 2023. They have declared their support for the candidacy of Vice President Professor Yemi Oshimbaju as president come 2023. The group said after careful consultation with like minds across the country, the general consensus was that Vice President Oshimbaju represented everything the nation needed to achieve greatness at this point in the nation's history. Here's the report. A gathering of one of the finest brains amongst women in the country, and their agenda is to aggregate views and strategize on ways to move the country into achieving greatness economically and politically. These women, who came from different walks of life and from the six geopolitical zones of the country, say it is time to ensure a round peg is fitted into a round hole in the country's polity. Chairperson of the steering committee, Ajia Rabi Dauda, highlighted the objective of the meeting, which is to ensure the emergence of Vice President Yemi Oshibajo as the next president of Nigeria. We strongly affirm Nigerian women's utmost confidence in the candidature of Professor Yomi Osibanjo as a people-focused leader with the right intellectual capacity and innate leadership qualities to move Nigeria forward with an emphatic attention to women progress and development. We demand the emergence of true, truly people-focused leadership at the APC's forthcoming convention and presidential primaries, either through consensus or voting processes. As we look forward to the unfitted emergence of Vice President Yumi Usibanjo. We are actually here because we want to support our a very wonderful man, uh, a man who is full of integrity, a man who is credible, a man who is loyal, a man of the people. You know, majority of Nigerians love Professor Yemi Osibanjo. Uh, with President uh, Yemi Osibanjo, a new dispensation is about to happen in Nigeria and it's going to take place in Nigeria. And we are going to, not, we are going to see a lot of changes. In the absence of the president, we have seen what he has done. We have seen how he has been able to effect changes. As an economist, though he's a lawyer or a professor, but we know that economically he's sound. And if the, this country is handed over to him, we will be economically sound. And the governors, government of the people, by the people, for the people, will be practiced. They were unequivocal about whom the next occupant of Aso Rock should be come 2023. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.